Hey there guys, welcome back to another video of all things Apple Plus. We have a great video for you guys today. Something that I've been meaning to show off, I've been doing some testing in the background and I wanted to show you guys this application Ad Protector Pro. If you haven't had a chance to download this, download this on uh, iTunes or even through the App Store, excuse me, I'm gonna leave a link for it in the description down below. Currently, at the moment as I'm making this video, there has just been a massive revoke for the uh, for the Kodos app movie, and I want to show you guys how I'm personally keeping this on my device and how I'm still able to run Coda movies. But again, this is the actual application that you're going to want to download. And I downloaded the pro version. It's about a dollar ninety nine for the actual application so it's not that much to keep your applications from being revoked and it's a really cool application i think it's just it's well worth the buck 99 just to be able to protect your applications i'm going to show you guys real quick in a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to get this shout out goes to sanders tech man this guy has done so much this is what the application uh, currently looks like and without his help and without him no notifying the the community about this i think there would be even less people who know about this so i'm just really much just relaying what he's put out there on the space and i just want to just give him the credit for this one this is actually a really cool application so let's actually navigate into twitter and i want to show you guys just that Kodo movies at the moment if you look them up even uh today as I'm, i was filming this yesterday but even today they even posted another tweet about having uh the application being revoked at the moment and they're working on uh fixing this and that the best way you can get this application is by running city impactor on your computer but currently my Kodo movies actually works and it works normally and it isn't being signed by my i by, or by um city impactor this is actually a downloaded version of the application so if you look under my uh profiles and device management the Kodo's movie application is still to this day still running off of their off of their signed service right now it's not off of my apple id at all and currently it's being revoked and they're showing that it's revoked on their end so through the help of this vpn you're able to make you're able to keep your applications that you've downloaded online or via safari on your iDevice and you won't have to worry about them being revoked anymore so this is a really cool tweak a little cool tutorial uh actually not even a tutorial but a little cool app that you can use to uh to keep yourself or from hint or keeping your iDevice from hindering it from allowing apple to uh, revoke any of these applications so in the link in the description i'm gonna leave a mediafire link you're gonna need to download this link via safari so make sure that you copy the link into safari and then make sure that you download it. it's a couple of bytes but it's these lists it's the list of uh domain names that you're going to need to make sure that you um that you block these via the ad protector app so make sure that you guys copy and then make sure that you navigate back into the application after that you've finished downloading it make sure that you go into privacy and then make sure that you uh, upload or make sure that you paste all these domain names in there and then hit done and then your app and then make sure that you do reset the actual VPN service that way you can uh, that way it can start to take into effect and then if you've downloaded any other applications later on from this make sure that you just shut off the VPN and then turn it back on real fast that way it can take into effect for the following app so if you get GBA for iOS or INDS for, or whatever what have you from Tweakbox or whenever in any app store or or any or at valley make sure that you just switch it off switch it back on and then it should go and take into effect for those applications so that way you don't have to worry about them from being revoked so it's just a really cool service i've had it on for about a week two weeks now and i haven't had any sort of revokes with coda movie so this is a really cool application i'm going to do some more testing on this one but if you guys did like this video if you guys like what we're doing here on the channel please like comment subscribe check out sanders tech i'll be leaving his youtube page his uh his link in the description down below so make sure you got you, do, you guys do check him out and i'll be catching you guys on the next video peace Extra, 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 extra,